Hi guys, I'm Bilal Rahman. Many of you know me as your favorite luxury interior designer from TikTok and Instagram, and guess what, bitches? I got the keys to our brand new headquarters and gallery in Houston. I am so excited to give you a tour of this space. It is 5,000 square feet of bad bitch energy, and you're gonna love every fucking inch of it. We are currently standing in what is going to be the immersive gallery space in the Bilal Rahman headquarters, and this is going to be a really unique shopping experience for any of your home needs. The really amazing thing about this space that attracted me to it was how expansive the windows were. I love all the natural light that floods through the space during the day, and we are right on Westheimer, so the visibility is tremendous. As you all know, something that is always near and dear to my heart is local artists. I am a big supporter of them. I only use local artists and small artists in my projects, and I love the fact that I am now creating a gallery which can house all of your work and showcase all of your stunning pieces. I am so fucking tired of the mass-produced artwork, and don't let me get started on that because I will not stop. But this gallery space is going to hold really unique pieces that are handmade by artists from across the country, which we are actually doing a TikTok competition on. If you go over to the TikTok, you'll find all the details because it's truly the least I could do for all those creatives out there who do not have a platform to showcase their work. We are still currently in the gallery space. Over here, this is going to be the checkout zone. We're gonna do this really cool custom feature wall behind it, which you'll see in a later video. And as you can see, all of the hideous fucking flooring has been ripped up. It had this dark, nasty brown wood that had scratches and dents all over it. So we just decided to ultimately rip it up and do new flooring throughout. I'm gonna take a poll on because I'm not sure yet. We, our team has been going back and forth on different options and I would love to hear what you guys have to think. And then moving on into the kitchen space, which is packed already with different things for the office. Um, this kitchen is massive. It is honestly too big for the space, but I'm so glad that we have it. Um, and right now it is a storage unit, as you can see, but it is currently all white and it has really basic hardware, really basic kind of a look to it. And we're gonna give this whole entire kitchen a entire makeover. It needs to be the lawified. <laughs> One of the things that really drew me to this space was actually how big this kitchen was because it's really important for me to have a space where my team can come, unwind throughout the day, grab a cup of coffee or their favorite snack, and really chill out and feel like they have a little moment of peace. The job that we do is so chaotic that having something like this is really important. And if you know me, you know that I snack all day long, so this kitchen will be stocked with every gummy candy you can imagine. Now, coming out of the kitchen and back into the gallery space, I want you to follow me through this incredible arch that our contractor added in. Originally, this was a little tiny square cut out and we just made it into this beautiful arch. He actually did this today and it looks so good. I've stared at it for like 30 times throughout this video. It is so incredible. But if you come in through the arch, this space is going to be a really unique room. It is going to be part of the gallery space and still carry merchandise, but it has this own vibe and it's this own theme to it that I cannot wait for you guys to see. Now leaving this room, this double entrance was just added today as well. Originally this was a single door which led into the office side of things, but I really feel like the single door was a little too small for the space, so we're opening it up to a double and this is where all the magic is going to happen. Welcome to Bilal Rahman's studio. So this space is going to be where all of our conference rooms, private offices, art studio, marketing studio, this is where anything pertaining to the Bilal Rahman brand is going to live. This space over here is going to be our massive sample library where, you know, we have all the fabrics and rugs and all that kind of stuff, as well as the open workspace. Um, this was actually used as a production facility prior to us, and so it had terrible rubber flooring and it has this horrible lighting, so all of it's gonna get redone, of course. Um, and you can even hear the drippy little sink in the corner that's been leaking since the day we got the keys. As you know, growing a brand is such a journey, and I really wanted to find a space that we could grow into and house all the creative energy and the creative people, as well as all the samples and things that we need to do our jobs in a very spaced out and organized way. And this space, between the gallery space and the office was laid out perfectly for what we needed. I think we looked at like 50 different properties before landing on this one, and this was the only one that spoke to us immediately. The second we walked in, we knew that this was it. Another thing that was really impressive about this space that not a lot of other spaces had was two bathrooms. This has one on the office side and one on the gallery side. So one for clients and one for staff. And I really feel like that separation is super important when you're trying to have a functional office as opposed to having everybody go to one bathroom. Now come with me to the gallery bathroom, which is a little bit better than that one, but still in need of some definite makeover. 
this door is also getting changed because this also leads into the office and I just felt like it was a little too small and too narrow. So we're replacing it with a big glass door, something that lets in a lot more light. This is actually, I have no idea what the fuck this is, but this has got to go. The gallery bathroom is right through this door and again, it is in need of some love. Now we are back in the main gallery space. I hope you enjoyed this tour. I know that it was a really quick rundown and it's not much to look at right now, but we're gonna do an entire series about the process of this office because I feel like I need to take you behind the scenes of this. Remember to elevate everyday experiences and stay tuned for the next video.